years ago I started this uh, hosting service for my clients and they are happy and they stay. So this is what I will be working on today. I need to find some better solution for CMS so we can, no CRM actually, so we can handle you know, incoming clients, their websites in a much more slick way for us. Currently living in a tiny house. That ended up to be our next destination. All right, yeah, we're going out for a coffee shop work session somewhere. Today I'm actually going to focus on editing my next YouTube video, but also um, I have to focus on uh, I have to focus on this the uh, hosting service. Um, that I started, we need to come up with a better CRM system. Quite a lovely pub shop here in this Norwegian city called Lindestone. Anyway, uh, shut up. I'm gonna do a stand, stand up desk today, do some work. You know, when I start my day, I usually do. I have to, I use an app for to do, but I also do, you know, in my black notebook and my magical pen. And um, sometimes I just like to be organic because I like to feel what I'm writing in. Uh, not have to punch into an app to see what's going on and quickly write down ideas and notes and stuff like that. So. When I started to have, you know, web design clients in Norway, a common thing that I saw is that they had such a shitty and cheap and terrible hosting service that I just thought to myself I come up I need to come up with something to to help them and for a few clients I started to offer this to them but on a much more premium price level so now my many of my customers they pay me $47 a month but then I, they get a completely different level of hosting it's much faster and more secure and you know we, offer, uh, we, we maintain WordPress for them every month make sure they have double layers of backups we maintain the WordPress system two times a month. Uh, they get custom SMTP email sending for WordPress and little things like that. So it kind of levels up to a more premium service hosting. Yep, that was three hours at this coffee shop. Very nice place, nice guy working there, running the place, good coffee and uh, perfect table height. Okay, yeah, I also got to spend some time on the new CRM, so we're actually trying to get, um, I'm actually trying to get a new deal on AppSumo, I guess you guys know about AppSumo. If you don't know about AppSumo, if you are one of the um, beginner freelancers or people working online, AppSumo is uh, of course the software marketplace online, super famous for all kinds of software and apps and web apps and stuff like that good business stuff and you can get lifetime deals great deals for super nice software and apps at times and I bought a lot there because of course if I can um, if I can get myself a lifetime deal for something I will be using in my business it's a lot of money saved and uh, I'm happy to pay one time for something instead of paying constantly the rest of my life every month I was stopping by seemingly the biggest shopping mall in Norway. Stormen Stor Center, I don't know. 
everybody claims to have the biggest shopping mall, so I don't know. I guess they aren't competing. One extension after the other. Uh, we just want to stop by because I need to uh, I take a look at uh, switching out my mouse. I want to test out uh, a little bit bigger mouse from Logitech. Okay, found a power store. I mean, it's called power here in Norway. And uh, oh, right, look at this. Yeah, so I was also looking for a memory card to this camera, the FX30. Okay, got the MX mouse. Fucking expensive, like 160 euros. But if it sucks and it doesn't improve my workflow, I return it. We just decided to stop by a Norwegian cabin exhibition. This is the kind of house we would like to have. Unplugged from the system, of course. Yeah, so me and Shield made here. We, of course, we have a fantasy about having, you know, our own space. And uh, I mean, if I could choose a house and what comes always back up in my mind is, uh, is houses like this. This is a typical Nordic style house. And um, some of the designs for these, I would say, have a lot of the traditional looks of buildings. Some of them even look like old Viking longhouses. Absolutely a place I could live in a house like this. It's actually a cabin, but uh, I would rather prefer a cabin with this style than, uh, you know, um, a traditional house. Back to our magnificent house. I currently, current stay, nice Airbnb. Yeah, I'm not completely happy with uh, my accomplishments today. You know, I had a checklist, um, and I still have things to do. So um, I will just be continuing here at home. You know, sometimes I put things on the checklist that's not necessarily technical stuff. But like today, I have a couple of items, um, you know, to keep myself updated. And uh, it's watching one YouTube video and also read an article I got on my email. So still got that to do. Mm -hmm. 